Last August, together with my colleague, Commissioner Howell, I had an opportunity to serve with one of the Salvation Army's canteens in southern Louisiana after Hurricane Ida. The cars were lined up down the street, waiting for food to be distributed from the canteen. But that canteen was far more than simply a food distribution point. It was a place where people from the community, their homes demolished, their businesses ruined, could come and talk to one another, share with one another, commiserate together. But what struck me that day was not only that those things were happening, but that they were then pitching in to help their neighbors. That was only one of 22 canteens that FedEx has provided to the Salvation Army since 2007. And you've not just done it here in the United States. You've provided canteens in Australia and in the United Kingdom and in Brazil and in Puerto Rico. In Salvation Army terms, friends, the sun never sets on the FedEx canteens. <laughs> <laughs> Over the years, therefore, you have done an extraordinary amount to help us help people. And I can tell you on behalf of hundreds of thousands of individuals, it has made a difference. The Evangeline Booth Award is the highest award that the Salvation Army can bestow. I can think of no organization more deserving of this highest honor from the Salvation Army than FedEx. So on behalf of all of us, thank you and God bless you. All of us representing 700,000 people around the world were proud to accept Red Rod, you want to? No, it's, uh, you know, we are in business to, to serve in any, many ways, so and we are really proud to be able to accept this award today. And uh, again, I like appreciate the recognition. Thank you for coming down today. Thank yeah, you, Yeah, absolutely. Thank Thanks you. to all of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.